Today is Monday, January 25th, 2016. We're going to take a look at emerging markets today. And it's really not so much for them, but for uh, for commodities, because they're very dependent on the commodities markets. And if we look at the stocks, we can get an idea where commodities are heading. And I know they're way oversold, and people are really interested in looking at them as cheap. But got to stay, stay with the charts. This is the emerging markets ETF, EEM. And you can see what's going on. Downtrend down here with RSI. You know, it was a little bit oversold last week. Not anymore. You can see the bounce in there thanks to the, uh, the oil recovery, temporary recovery anyway. And we can just move around through other ETFs. This is Latin America. You know, it's the same story. Straight down. You can also look at Brazil specifically because it's a one of the bricks, one of the supposed powerhouses, but one look at this chart, and this is not a powerhouse by any means. Let's take a look at it weekly. I mean, here it is below the 2008 lows. So this is bad news. It's not even oversold in the weekly. So just just uh, heading straight down. Let's take a look at a few others just for kicks. Russia, this is the Russia ETF RSX. Also down close to the 08 lows, not quite there, but now this one is very oil dependent. And if we go back to daily, you can really see that oil bounce last week and then a little weakness um, today. So not a whole lot of high level technicals on this one. Just looking at the trends of these emerging markets ETFs and they're straight down and they don't look oversold to me. So just bad news for them and bad news for commodities.